Hey, 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 what's going on? You're standing in front of my son. What's that? Is this a nude beach? No, this is not Gunnison Beach on Sandy Hook. And just because I'm not wearing clothes, I'm a raisin, for goodness sakes, a raisin. Yeah, yeah, raisin in the sun. <laughs> Very funny. Oh, I look like a clam to you. Let me ask you. You ever seen a talking purple clam? No, I'm purple, so that makes me a raisin, right? Oh, you don't believe me. Okay, okay, you got me. I'm a clam. But I ain't so delicious like the other clams here at the Jersey Bay Shore, so don't be getting any ideas. What about you? Who are you to ask all these personal questions about what species I am? Hey, I get it. You're a Benny asking all these questions. You are definitely and undeniably a true Benny. And so, now the shoes on the other, uh, uh, whatever you humans have down there. Okay, unfold your beach chair, stick your umbrella in the sand, and I'll tell you what's what around here from a raisin's, I mean a clam's point of view. Name's Clem, like I said, I'm a clam, but I'm not to be eaten. Understand? Never eat a purple clam unless it's in an Easter basket. Understand? Okay, good. Well, what's your first question, my fine feathered Benny? Ah, good question. What's a Benny? Well, we try to keep it a secret around here and only call you Benny behind your back just before summer, like, the Bennies are coming, the Bennies are coming. Yeah, no, we're a little paranoid. I guess you have a right to know, but don't tell anybody around here. I told you, they'd eat me right out of the half shell if they found out I was yapping about it. All right, the official Urban Dictionary describes a Benny as a summer tourist here at the New Jersey Bay Shore. And you come from other parts in New Jersey or the Big Apple or as far away as the city brotherly love. By the way, I love your cheesesteaks, but you gotta hold the grease. Bivalves are good at filtering, but not grease. Not so much. Grease, grease, grease is bad. Anyway, according to the definition, which I have memorized for occasions such as these, you Bennies like to come down here for a day, two days, or a week at the most with your family or romantic interest. And you do this because you know, you truly believe, that your Jersey Bayshore is both a family-oriented vacation spot, according to our sources, and you are extremely romantic. Although you, I, I, I have my doubts. Anyway, you Bennies actually voted in some magazine for the Jersey Bay Shore as one of the best places in the state of New Jersey for romantic getaway. <laughs> How sweet. Just keep it in your room, pal. Okay, and here's an interesting factoid. You Bennies like to make a point of showing off by flashing large amounts of cash, usually $100 bills. You know, we don't have much of that around here. We don't have a lot of money. I am open to gratuities for my well-founded advice, so feel free to stuff a hundred in my shell. Okay, what else? Oh, yeah, you're a Benny because you got a camera. That's a dead giveaway. So, that's a lovely camera you have there. How come you never take pictures with clams? We see you taking pictures of one of our magnificent scenic overlooks, frequently exclaiming, Oh, I had no idea that New York City was so close to here. And things like, Oh, look, look, you can actually see this or that from here. And then you say, Wow, look at all the ships in the Atlantic Ocean. Well, we're kind of used to people being surprised at the great views. Oh, you have pictures you want me to look at right now. Oh, yes, well, yeah, yeah, no need. I've seen your posts on Facebook. They're very, very, very nice. But again, no pictures of clams. Let me also guess, you've spent some time in your car, yes, clogging up our local roadways while we are trying to get somewhere important, like trying to get to our boats or to the place where they serve great food on the waterfront, not clams, however, or maybe we're trying to cross the bridge over to Sandy Hook, and guess what? All of you Bennies are trying to cross the bridge at the same time. It's why we had to build a new one. Too many Bennies. And being a clam, I'm very interested in water quality around here. Seems like all I do is filter the waterways because you keep throwing your beer cans over the side of your boat. Really? Really? Would I throw stuff in your backyard? No, I would not. In fact, I wouldn't even be in your backyard. We like to keep our 35 miles of beautiful beaches on the river, bay, or ocean somewhat clean. And incidentally, here's a question for you. Why are so many Bennies concerned about swimming? in our rivers or the bay. You afraid of our man-eating bivalves? We ain't gonna kill you. We're delicious. We swim in the rivers and bay all the time because the water is clean, thanks to us bivalves filtering it every chance we get. And what's best about our river and bay beaches? They're not too crowded because you bannies always try to force-fit yourselves onto one of the Sandy Hook beaches. 
Well, that's okay. That's okay with us. Just gives us more room. Don't be telling any of the other bennies I told you this little secret, even though I shouldn't tell you what I'm about to tell you. Now you'll just jump in your car and start clogging up our roadways again. Here it goes. There's actually a lot more to do and see here at the Jersey Bay Shore than just lying in the sun and cooking like a flag steak with a side of boardwalk fries. You ready for this? The New Jersey Bay Shore has plenty of history you can actually see. This was the crossroads of the American Revolution. This is where you can see the British fighting the American patriots so clams could be free of British domination. It's all here. Shopping in some great little all-American towns for almost anything your heart desires. We got antique stores, house and garden tours, boat rides, fishing, crabbing, and even scuba diving and parasailing. And sad to say, we still have folks who go clamming. But I'm working hard to get it out, Lord. Probably not in my generation, though. Lately, I've been smelling garlic on linguine for some reason. Anyway, speaking of clams, why is it so hard for you bennies to shell out some extra clams so your kids or girlfriend can actually spend the night with us? You afraid we might do something crazy with them? We do have places where you can stay comfortably for the night, instead of racing down the Garden State Parkway to get home after a beautiful day at the beach. You ever hear the concept of a bed and breakfast? We even have some of those newfangled hotels. Oh, here's an idea. Maybe you've got some friends here you can actually stay with. Or if you don't act like one of those regular bennies, maybe you can even make some new friends and start staying with them. We're actually pretty friendly here at the Jersey Bay Shore, but lots of you bennies have already left our area to spend your time on the turnpike in traffic while the sun goes down. What a waste of a good sunset. Why not stay the night and then you can go on one of our sunset cruises where you again might actually have to shell out a few clams, pardon the expression, so your family or friends can have the time of their lives. So stop being so cheap and live a little. We actually enjoy your money as much as you do. So if you do stay the night, our nightlife is fantastic. Unfortunately, most of the bennies have left the building by the time the sun goes down. But if you do stay, there's lots to do. We've got a big amusement park right on the water with beaches, a fishing pier, and everything. We've got clubs and restaurants, outdoor concerts, and even shopping when the stars come out to shine over Raritan Bay. But no, you go right ahead and use your easy pass to the express lane so you can get home as quickly as possible. And no, if you're easily frightened when the lights go out and stay away from our haunted houses, we have several of these spooky places which also give tours you won't catch me in one of those places. I'm feeling kind of clammy just thinking about it. Oh, you're a Benny, all right. I can see your eyes getting bigger. But don't look at me that way. I'm not delicious. Well, all right. I am delicious, but not right this minute. Think about something else, like a brand name restaurant like Burger Queen, McDougal's, and their friendly meals, as well as Black Olive Garden. Stop. Stop, 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 stop. Don't ever think about places like that. You might as well be home, for goodness sakes. Have you ever thought of actually entering a restaurant to sample the local fare with local people, or do you hunger for the sameness of your boring, everyday existence? This is the Judgy Bay Shore. There's nothing regular about our lives, and we like it just fine. Who knows, you may like it too. And the clams ain't so bad either, except just not right now. All right, my friend, I've got to get back into the water to do a little filtering. A bivalve's work is never done. And look at the time. Shouldn't you be thinking about checking your email or texting somebody? If you do connect with the modern world while you're getting back to nature here at the Jersey Bay Shore, I think it's crazy. But if you do, then you might as well visit jerseybayshore.com and take a look at the hundreds of videos showing you exactly what's what, where to go, what to see, and how to get where you want to go. That's jerseybayshore.com. Hey, you ain't bad for a Benny. Maybe we'll run into each other on Gunnison Beach and I'll slap some lotion on your back. Or maybe not. Check you later, pal. Check you later.